Hi guys, welcome to another video. These are the Morris Minor seats, old Maggie seats, that have gone a little bit saggy. It's mainly because the strapping underneath it has uh, broken. So we're going to give it a new lease of life. Uh, we've got some uh, upgrade kits from Moss Europe, not affiliated, bought them with my own money, blah blah blah. Um, uh, instead of the webbing system which tends to cut into the um, the foam on the bottom of the seats this is actually a rubber mat so it's a big rubber mat suspended on uh, several clips quite easy to do I've done it on this one that I'm sat on right now um, purely so I know what I'm doing so that you know I don't look like a idiot on the camera um, Taking the Morris Minor seats out will require somebody with some form of degree, um, extremely qualified in engineering. Uh, but if you get yourself on YouTube, uh, there's plenty of videos on there telling you how to take them out. And once you've mastered undoing the four bolts that secure it at the front, they come out quite easily. So let's get on with it. Okay guys, done. Quick and easy job. Yeah, not too complex. The instructions are crap. Uh, mainly because you can't see the pictures that it tells you to refer to. Because uh, it's a photocopy of instructions. And the pictures are completely blacked out, so you can't actually see them. Um, so, yeah, all done. Uh, the It turns out that the driver's seat, the one that I'm sat on now, had got two layers of foam on them. Uh, somebody had clearly tried to bulk it out a little bit. Um, but no need now, new seat base, base is fitted, they're nice and spongy. Uh, so we'll get them back in the car, so I just need to bring back that engineer and uh, uh, person with major degrees in law and physics to try and work out how to put these bad boys back in. But once I've got the four bolts back into the chassis, I think we'll be alright. So uh, thanks for joining us. Uh, it's only a real quick video, but um, remember to like and subscribe. See you again.